Hey there folks, today I want to talk to you about the North Shore Mega Max Adult Diaper. Recently I was exploring the idea of rebooting this channel and I figured a great way to start would be with the North Shore Mega Max Adult Diaper. Now that said, uh, before we talk too much more about this channel, let me go over the details on my thoughts on this diaper and how it performs, and then we'll discuss a little bit about the future of this channel. The first thing to note about the Mega Max is it kind of has a, a little bit of an odd sizing that I've heard is a little bit problematic for some people, especially for those that are right about my waist range. So I'm at about a 32, 34, I'm like right in between 32 and 34. Recently I've lost some weight. So I wasn't too sure which size to tell them to send me. I had them send me both small and medium. So it turns out uh, if you are right at that 32 range size range, uh, I would actually recommend going with the small over the medium. Uh, the medium has a tendency, while it fits, it has a tendency to sag a bit once it gets wet and it would happen in such a way that it may cause rashes. So that's not really totally ideal. It'll keep you protected, but it's not really a great fit. It also may vary depending on your body shape uh, and size. So there may be some differences in people, uh, but I think in overall, uh, the small would be better for a size 32. Now that said, uh, the performance of the product is itself, I found it does last anywhere from eight to 10 hours. Uh, I honestly wouldn't recommend wearing it for 12 hours, at least not regularly. Uh, personally, for me, I have a little bit of sensitive skin and I would definitely get a rash if I try to do that. Um, so definitely be aware of that, but other than that, it performs really well. I'm actually wearing it right now, and you can't even really tell. It's really discreet, you can't really hear it crinkle, um, and I'm even wearing sweatpants, and you wouldn't really even be able to tell that I was wearing one. So it's really great in that regard, offers a lot of great protection, it lasts a long time, and the other really good thing about it is that the tapes are they're really strong and very resealable. So if you're not bowel incontinent and you need to untape the side to go to the bathroom, uh, you can easily do that and re-tape it back up without any issues at all. The other cool thing to note about it is it does come in, in a variety of awesome prints that make it a little bit more enjoyable to wear, in my opinion. Uh, I'm always, always a fan of the classic white myself, but uh, I did find myself enjoying wearing these as well. I don't know why. <laughs> it's not like anybody sees me in them. But that said, I mean, that's really my basic rundown of this product. It's really an excellent product for managing incontinence or if you just enjoy wearing diapers, whatever the case may be. That said, I don't know, maybe if I do videos like this where I'm just straight talking at the camera and there's gonna be very little editing, maybe I can do some more of these videos. But to be honest with you guys, I was kind of dreading doing this video and uh, I really would much rather be working on some creative projects. So some of you may know I have an art channel, an art website. Uh, I do also do some other stuff on TikTok. Um, and I, to be honest with you guys, I really prefer doing that a lot more. So I'm kind of second guessing this whole Diaper Dynamo reboot uh, at this point. Uh, but I don't know, we'll see how it goes. Cause honestly, the editing of the video part is the part that I dread the most. And if I can keep it quick and easy in one shot like this and just cut out the parts where I'm messing up, maybe I can make that work. It's kind of up in the air at this point. I promise you guys this one video, everybody got all excited for it. So I felt like I had to do at least this one video, especially since North Shore was kind enough to send me their product to, re to review. Oh, one other little fact that I picked up along the way. Uh, I did actually weigh the product before and after. And on average, these weigh about seven ounces dry. Um, and then it can expand up to about three pounds worth of weight. So that's a pretty substantial absorbency factor. Uh, that's really my best way of doing it. Normally I would show the scale, but again, for the sake of keeping this video nice and simple, I'm just gonna do this talking straight at the camera. So if you got any value this video and you did enjoy it, do me a favor, hit that like button and maybe throw something down in the comments. Maybe we have a little discussion. We'll see where this channel goes. I don't wanna make any promises on any future videos at this point. I'm just gonna play it by ear and maybe, maybe if I feel like it, every once in a while, throw one out there. But at this point, I just, I'm really feeling a little bit uncertain about trying to commit to continuing this channel when I have so many other things I'm trying to do that really require more of my focus, especially if I want to advance myself and my skill set. So until next time, stay dry.